so I just got some packages in the mail that I wanted to show you guys. The first thing is these at pair of shoes. I actually got these from Lulu's. Um, they're one of my favorite um, clothing websites to buy my shoes from. They're super affordable. They're so durable and worth the price. Um, I'll link these down below. I'm pretty sure they're 35 bucks. I got a size 7 and I got them for this weekend. It's going to be our anniversary weekend. Don't worry, I'm vlogging it, but we're going to fail. And this is going to look so freaking perfect with one of the dresses that I want to wear. So, super excited for that. And then I'm super excited because one of my cutest subscribers ever um, is making, just start, opened up an Etsy shop. And she sent me some earrings that she made and some little badge reel clips, which I'm super excited for because those are so fun. Um, but look how cute. It's just CourtneyJ.co. Um, thank you so much for supporting my small business. Your support means so much to me, follow us. And then she gave me such a freaking cute little note, and I love you so much, Courtney. Thank you. But these are so cute. That one literally says RN. That makes me so excited. This one says that spread love, not germs. And then I got some cute earrings. These are going to be so freaking pretty in the fall. Oh my goodness, these are stunning. These ones are so cute. They have pumpkins on them. I'll get them out to show you a better clip. Here are these ones all close together spread love not germs so cute i love that blue color and the sparkles and this one's so cute it's like the little hands are like pulling it off the chest and it says rn and it's gold if you guys can tell and we all know how i feel about gold so yeah i'm super excited courtney again thank you so much you guys if you're interested in any of this i will link all of her stuff down below so you guys can get your own and again i'll link my shoes too I know I haven't even started off the vlog yet, but I need to show my Pride and Joy waffles. <laughs> These are the Trader Joe gluten-free waffles, and then we've been putting our blueberry and strawberry mixture on them with some chia seeds, unsweetened coconut, and then dairy-free So Delicious Cocoa Whip, and it's so good, and I just have to share, because is that not the prettiest little thing you've ever seen? Oh God, I know. I know. Welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell this video started with like a little week in the life um, Monday and Tuesday I Wanted to film as I was planning to do week in life, but Monday Josh um, Forgot to tell me that he had invited some friends over um, One of his best friends from childhood like they grew up in the same neighborhood together um, is leaving he's moving to San Francisco so Josh Last minute had lunch with him on Sunday. That's why my weekend in the vlog life got so messed up too. Um, but everything's Josh's fault. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, so that was just crazy. So we just like ended up deep cleaning the crap out of our apartment um, after all the clips that you saw. And um, yeah, I just like forgot to film because I was like in such a panic because like I feel like people, I mean, I totally get it now when my mom used to freak the F out about um, the house being clean when guests were coming because like I just went full panic mode. Everything had to be tip top shape for everyone. Um, so I did that and then we had to go to King's to get some grilling food and stuff like that. And then by the time we came back and got ready and everything, it was just super late and I was just like, whatever, I'm not going to vlog. So that's that. And then yesterday, Tuesday... I had a really productive day and then I had forgotten because I was so busy on Monday the amount of stuff that I wanted to try and get done on Monday so instead of doing it I got frustrated and instead went shopping with Taylor um, so now that is all going to be having having to happen today and tomorrow because I have an exam on Friday so I need to also make time tomorrow in the evening to study for that I've been studying a little bit before bed each night um, I've really spaced out my studying and it's definitely helped me a lot when um, I'm, ta I'm taking my exam so I can go over that too in a video or something but 
just want to say sorry and here's my official start to the vlog since i've failed so miserably but i'm going to focus a lot on making today and tomorrow productive days we're also going to veil on friday um we're leaving early in the morning i'm gonna take my exam up there at the um in the hotel and after that we're gonna go to dinner and stuff it is our four-year anniversary week we don't know our exact anniversary date so pretty much whenever we can take time off work and school to go celebrate is in that first week of september is the day that we usually celebrate it on uh, and that's just like is what works for us so we're gonna have a productive day today i'm gonna show you guys some things on how i get productive which is why i actually started the vlog here because i need to get out my busy bee journal if you guys have been following me since last summer you know that I got this cute little Busy Bee journal from TJ Maxx. It's so cute and literally it's just like where I put all my checklists. Like this one literally is all the way back from like December. So I have a lot of stuff in here and I just wanted to show you guys kind of how my checklists are. I've been adding lots of colors and fun stuff to make them more fun. So we're going to do that and we're going to have a productive day. I'm going to go put a sweatshirt on because I'm already freezing. What's new? Um, but I'll show you guys my little planner right now. I had to get some new highlighters, so it's definitely oddly colored and weird right now, but ooh, my bad. Anyways, obviously I haven't done my VSIM for this week, which is like our online clinical, it's that video game. I already did a video on that. I can put a card right here if you guys haven't seen that. Um, oh, why am I out of breath? All I did was go get a sweatshirt. Anyways, then yesterday I did do all of this. I printed out my notes so I can start studying for next week's um, stuff, which I can also go over in a future video. I'm actually getting pretty good at studying new material while finishing the old material. Um, I need to, I edited this video, but I need to um, finish it and like add music and stuff and little transitions. And then this math refresher, I actually did it twice last night and I'm so mad because I got, I needed an 85 and both times I got an 84 out of 85 and I'm missing like the dumbest, like the, you, the dumbest, let me tell you, the dumbest, if you didn't get the first time, the dumbest questions ever and it's like actually embarrassing and I got so mad last night. And to be fair, I was extremely tired by the end of the day when I started it. So it was partially just like my fault. And I was like laying lazy on the couch and stuff. So hopefully I can knock that out in one try today. Because if I don't get in my third try, I don't know what I'm going to do. I have to do... So we're doing Swift River. And I think a lot of you know what Swift River is. I'm extremely annoyed about it. Because we just did all of the like online video game virtual simulations and like all of those packets that those come with and I just think it's super annoying because I mean we literally just spent like I don't know it's just like a lot of work to put on us in the weeks that we have one big exam and then we're preparing for a cumulative on top of new material final exam so it's just like it's frustrating but and then we have a discussion board about it. Oh my god, you guys don't even get started. I really hate my school right now and I wish I could transfer. Like I'm so mad. Um, but so then today I was going to get the med surge patients one done. I have my online class stuff that's due tonight, which usually I finish that you guys in like 30 minutes. This joke, don't even come at me. This class is a joke. Because it's just it's just it's just a joke. It's bad. Then I wanted to get both there's two different or there's four medication administration ones and they're like a lot of scenarios in it so i wanted to try and get one and two done um and then try and get as much done as i can of the stuff i need to get done before veil that way also tomorrow like from noon until the end of the day i can study for this exam so i'm going to show you guys how i like to condense all of this um and sometimes it helps me get more done honestly so i'll go into my handy dandy notebook and I'll just find a clear page. And I like to take everything that I'd like to absolutely get done today and put it at the top. And then if I get lucky and I have more time, I add whatever else I'd like to get done um, after those. But I like to prioritize the ones that are going to be the most important and have like time, like due dates, I guess. So I'll just name this Wednesday checklist and then I'll show you guys. I actually just got these new highlighters. One of my lovely subscribers said she watched some other people on YouTube who had them and 
she thought of me because I'm psychotically annoying with highlighters and my planners and stuff. So thank you, baby. You're so cute, and I love that you said that. So I got all of these cool. They're the mid liners or yeah, mild liners. Um, I don't know. I just got them off Amazon. And they're really cool. They come in a lot of different colors. Some of them aren't as neon as I would like, but they're cute. And they have like the pointed end that you can write with and then the highlighting end. So we love that. Um, but what I'm going to do is start adding stuff to my list. <laughs> Just like that I now have my little checklist I like to do little squared boxes so I can mark them off and then I also cross through these little circles um, and then I also go in and for each class just to keep it organized and I know which class I'm doing what for I like to go in and um, highlight them so for vSIM it's that class is my um, is orange then my YouTube stuff is always purple. Um, presentation reading. This class is green. And then my math refresher class. Um, this is all um, Swift River. And because I hate it so much, I designated that as the color gray. But this checklist is already looking so sad. So we are going to just do blue because it is for med surge one and that's what color med surge one is so okay so this is my final checklist and i'll show you guys kind of how i go through and cross it off but i really want to get this done and out of the way because that's like the most easy thing um out of my school stuff um because i have such a routine down for it so i'm gonna get that done god my nails are so gross now i need to go get them done um and then we will move on to the rest So it's been a hot minute, but I finished um, my vSIM and I've pretty much finished editing this video. I still need to upload the link and send it to the company um, that I'm working with in it, which is a really cool watch company. So if you guys saw that and like them, I'm obsessed with my watch and I'm so excited about it. Um, but I did wait for Josh to come back home to change. He's going to go hit some golf balls while I work on some school stuff. But we went out there and I filmed a little car tour video for this. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I know it's like been like a few days since this video was in place. But I just kind of wanted to, I don't know, show you guys the cars since we talked about them in the video. And then I just kind of left y'all hanging. So I thought that would be a good way to finish off the video. And I finally did an outro. I've been so bad at doing outros on my videos. I feel like by the end of the video, I'm just like so toasted. That I'm just like, all right, we're out of here. So super stoked that i got that in there you guys can see our fun little cars in it so that will be fun um i'm just gonna go through and add some music and some little um transition screens and stuff just to add a little razzle dazzle and then that will while that's uploading we can work on our online class homework and then hopefully get a couple more of these swift river stupid clinical things done I just finished um, all my online class stuff. I'm really tired. We do these readings for them. It comes in like a presentation looking form and while they're easy to read and they make the quizzes and the discussion posts a lot easier, they're just very time consuming and tiring. So I just spent like a good like 40 minutes on that. But now that we are done with that, I have my swift river things left i obviously need to do the math refresher one first to get that out of the way and then hopefully i can go into some medication administration ones 
I have dinner with my friend Savannah tonight at 5.30. So I only have about 45-ish minutes, maybe an hour, um, until I need to go put on some makeup. Um, I already did like my base layer stuff, but I need to add like mascara and stuff like that. And change, and then I'll meet her. And then I'll probably pick up whatever's left and try and get it done first thing tomorrow morning. And honestly, whatever I don't get done with the Swift River stuff, it's not due until next Wednesday. I just kind of wanted to get it out of the way this week. But that's okay. Um, my studying for my exam needs to come first. So I'll probably study a little bit tonight before bed, actually. That's probably a better idea. And then do some of these tomorrow in the morning. And then whatever I don't finish, push till next Monday and Tuesday now that I don't have sim class anymore. Um... This week was my last week of that, so I'm super stoked about that. But, yeah. I'm gonna take a break, get some water, put on some chapstick, and chill for a minute, and then hopefully finish this math refresher and then go to dinner. Okay, sorry. It is really dark in here, and I did not plan that. But I am about to go get my nails done. It is now Thursday. It is currently 12, 16. I need to get my nails done and I went to Zara, as you guys saw on Tuesday, with Taylor and I got some things and unfortunately you can't try them on there so I had to buy them, bring them back, or try them on and they're not, they're, they fit, they're cute. Like I got these like green leather pants and stuff and I think they're cute, but I just don't like the way they, they like flatten my butt really bad. And I ain't doing this Parky Peach plan for nothing. So I got that, and then I got like a cute top that, I don't know, I'm in between. And then the other top, my boobs were just like, hey, everybody. So we just can't do that. But I'm very excited. I did not finish a lot of my homework yesterday i finished everything that had a due date but everything that's still due next week that i was just wanting to get out of the way i didn't get to start um because we had to hurry up and get ready for dinner and stuff with savannah so um i'm going to do all this go home and then work on that while doing laundry and in between packing and stuff for veil um and i'll probably throw a little bit of some packing stuff in there and like how i like do the things that i do like health wise and stuff while we're on little trips like this but yeah nothing crazy so just want to update you guys but we're gonna go get our nails done i think we're gonna do the white glow in the dark um so that my nails look pretty with everything this weekend and then i think the next time we go we're gonna go for the black baby we're gonna go for some halloween colors but i'm gonna go through the colors i could change my mind when we're there but yeah so i just got done getting my nails done so i'm pretty sure this is like the exact same color i got last time i picked out the white one but i think maybe because of the glow in the dark stuff it can't get that white i don't know if you guys can see that the sun is like really gnarly but I also got like a rounded shape. I left them the length that they were. I asked them to go maybe a tiny bit shorter and then round them um, because I have really nubby thumbs. I just like, it looked really bad. I had like really bad looking thumbs. We're gonna put on some pumpkin cake lotion because they can't do the lotion thing right now. So we're gonna do it our own. Um, but yeah, I'm now going to the mall and I decided to keep that green shirt. I was like, okay, really? It was $12. You'll make something of it. It'll be fun. So we kept that. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, it's fall, baby. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go to the mall, return that, and then I think we might go to Target, because like why wouldn't we if we're over there? So that's the update. Those are the nails. And I don't know if, if it is the same color. They'll be the same glow in the dark color as they were last time, but if they are actually the white, I think it'll be like a more of like a green or blue color. So that's cool, I guess. <laughs> I always feel like a kid being like, Do you have the glow in the dark color? And then they're just like, yeah, you like the glow in the dark? I'm like, oh my god, I love it. And they're just like, okay, you're weird. Okay, we're gonna go to the mall.
I just got out of Target and I'm so excited. So I got some greenies for Sven and I found a new collar for him that I'm really excited about. Um, I also found a couple or like three really tiny items from the dollar section of their Halloween stuff. Um, it's just the rest of it is so trashy and I hate it, but these things will be cute. They're going to go with our costumes. And so I kind of want to like see if I can prop everything up for like a cute little photo wall because we are having like a little get together with all of our friends for Halloween this year. But like or we're only inviting the people that have taken like their precautions seriously for the whole COVID thing. Um, so we're really excited for that, but I thought it would be a cool little way to like prop up some stuff for um, Oh god, this target guy just walked by and is totally judging me But I think it would be really cool for it to um, Just make like a little proppy little area um, I'll kind of show you guys my plan when I get home But I'm dying of heat. I'm literally my mustache is literally sweating 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 so I'm going to stop by Starbucks and then we're gonna go get Josh and Sven and go to um, Petco and see if we can find Sven another like little winter jacket or something. Just cause I love torturing him and I love dressing him up cause I'm that mom. So that's the plan, but we're gonna go to Starbucks now. Good, how are you? Doing well, what can I get you? Can I do a grande coffee frappuccino? And then is there a way what you can do like the mocha sauce in it. Isn't that dairy free? Yeah, that would just be a mocha frappuccino. Okay, and then with um, almond milk. Okay, and I'm guessing now with cream? Yes, please. <laughs> cool, anything else? Uh, no, thank you. All right, one is six and ten, come on down. Thank you so much. Of course. Woo, she's hot out today. I'm so hot. I also think I'm either going to order like a skeleton pancake maker or like the little waffle one or a pumpkin one. I thought they had them at Target, but they don't. So I wanted to see them in person. So I think I'm going to just order on Amazon and hope that it's cute. I bought it. I got the skeleton one with a little chargeable lighter. So that's cool. I'm okay, thank you. Thank you so much. I was gonna tell her to have a good day, but she walked away, so, okay. Alright, let's go get our boys and let's go to PetSmart and make Sven wear a really stupid but cute, oh so cute, winter jacket to fail this weekend. So this is the new collar that we got Svenny Boy and he loves it! Nice. And then these are the only two Halloween things I walked away with. Um, like I said, I think they're going to just make some cute simple decor for our picture for our Josh and I's Halloween costume and then for the little party. And then we had to go get Svenny a new little jacket. Well, obviously we didn't have to, but I wanted to. Because his last one was so cute, but he got so big and see, I growed out of it. So we got him a new one and it's so cute. And these little buttons are gold. So you love it. And then we got him some like greenies and snacks and stuff. Because hey, that breath, your breath smells so bad. Yes. This is his old collar Josh is currently taking off. It's just too little for him. So we're going to put this one on the baby. Are you excited? <gasps> so I got um, my camera back. I forgot it, so I wasn't really vlogging a lot, but we came home packed and then probably spent a good like 45 minutes on TikTok next to each other in bed, so that's good. And then we made some dinner and I just put on some tanning stuff and I'm about to go to bed. I'm actually, even though it's Thursday, going to end the video here because tomorrow is like the start of our anniversary weekend and I wanna make that, oh, <clears throat> excuse me. I wanna make that an entire vlog in itself. So that's what we're gonna do. But I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And next week, you guys, I'm going to be showing you a ton of how I study for my med search stuff since I didn't really cover it this week because there's just, it's like a whole explanation, but it'll come in next week's video. So yes, I will see you guys in that one.